Hey there folks, welcome back to the channel. I have here another super cool electromechanical arcade game from the Silver Ball Retro Arcade and Museum in Asbury Park, New Jersey. This one is called Sharpshooter by Chicago Coin from 1971. I love awesome games like this. Look at that cool rifle. If you do too, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and you hit the notification icon so you're notified next time I upload a video like this as I have a bunch more of these coming. Again, this one is called Sharpshooter. It says you're a shooting gallery. It's basically a simulation of, a, like, say, a, a real rifle shooting gallery, I suppose. Um, it's a sort of standard shooting game. The, 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 uh, that rifle is really awesome, isn't it, though? It looks like it's really deep into the playing field, but it's really mirrors that that's how they do that effect. But you can see it looks like there's you know, sides there and targets. The instructions is a game of skill. It's your coin. Try to hit the left and right candles when lit for first to score 200 each, and then, then try to shoot a bunch of other targets, I guess. Uh, 25 shots per game, if you get 3,400 3, points, you extend the play, and I try to show down there in the mirror, but it's really hard to tell, actually. And then, again, it has this awesome rifle. I mean, I just love these things here. Um, like, I'm trying to hold it here and uh, move it around. It's chained to the thing, and you can't even limit motion, but it certainly feels like a real rifle, and it's a lot of fun just to hold on to this thing and, and play it and pretend you're actually, you know, in a real uh, shooting gallery. So here's the game in action. Unfortunately, I don't think my son actually read the instructions because he didn't try to shoot the candles first. He's just basically shooting the unicyclist in the back, but every time you hit it, it goes back and forth. He did eventually get some other targets like the bullseye in the middle and some of those, uh, those somersaulting things, whatever that is. But uh, I don't think he got enough points to get additional shots, where it's based on shots, not on time. You can use, take as much time as you want, I believe, as long as you don't run out of bullets. You can see their points are racking up here, but it wasn't exactly quite enough. But definitely a very fun game. I played it as well, and I definitely recommend if you can find this or another game like it, you give it a try. And uh, like I said, stay tuned for the, this channel. There'll be more videos like this. Let me know what you think in the comments section, and have a great day, everybody.